Hello everybody and welcome back to Horizon Forbidden West where I did fast travel uh, but I did so because Outlander. Come and oh hang on. okay I'll look at this but Carl mostly I want to get I want to try out the new face paints and there is face paint here uh canister roadcaster here it is and here's the bell blast Shock bolt blaster, iron. Oh, an acid gauntlet. That's sick. Canisters can be detonated with an arrow of the same. I think I'm gonna buy it. I've been, I've been wanting it. And it's got ice, electricity, and fire. It's pretty awesome. I'm sure, we'll get there. Let's see. Do have some things. I need to hang out near waterfalls. It's where it's where the it's where the good stuff's at. Holy moly! So that rope caster was blue too. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Excellent. Yes. Instead of firing ropes, they use canister harpoons that can attach. Oh. Oh, maybe this, again, this is not what I thought it was going to be. I thought it was going to be a rope caster. Come and make your choice. Um, I thought it was going to be a rope cat, like, still, like, have, like, like tie them down with ropes, but with, a di with like, the additional payload of a canister that you could explode. But instead, <laughs> it's going to be something else, it appears. Man. Man. I'm looking for the. Come here. Come here. Oh, the yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, why don't you guys have any of your armors? Why can't I buy any of the cool Tanakh armors? Let's have a trade. Yeah, well, you don't have what I want, so no trades. These for you. Hey, guess the stranger should choose his work. Ooh, I do like the Tanakh Three Con. Tanakh Conqueror looks good too. Did I? When did I get that one? Conqueror or Recon? You know what I just kind of realized, too, is... Well, no, that doesn't make any sense. I was going to say, this gives me very kind of, like, American, like, Americana vibes. Um, like, with, it's, you know, blue, white, but kind of a pinkish red. Um, and, obviously, the March of the Ten, or, like, or the, the Ten Soldiers or whatever, they were American, right? Um... This one, this one in particular, gives me very like, uh, like, woo, America, like, like, like football paint vibes, you know, um, and it is. I think it's because this the paint is a little redder. It's, it's uh, this one's pinker and this one's redder. Um, which, eh, like, I get it, if that's what the. But I wonder, like, of all the tribes, it was apparently the Sky Clan, that apparently got those colors I wonder if they found those colors like associated more with it and this this is a sky clan too right yeah then why are they this was okay this is lowland okay I was like then why are they separated like this that doesn't make any sense this is lowland so the lowland tribe actually is a bit more Americana than the sky tribe which, this would make sense. Taken from inspiration, I just need to read. I just need to read. Taking inspiration from the visions of the memorial grove, the paint is often worn by lowland to not scouts as they quietly survey the vast jungle of the rain trace. Okay. I was like, this, that, I was like, why are they, I thought they were like mixed them all up. Nope. They did not. They do have them separated out because the game is smarter than I am. Uh, <laughs> that's, okay. <laughs> okay, okay. I just thought this was the one I just got. 
So that's why I thought it was a sky one. But apparently, no, I got the Tanakh Tactician just now, I think. Interesting that the others didn't particularly want that. But again, like we, like I was trying to say before I kept interrupting myself, their proximity to the Memorial Gardens makes this make sense. Why they would have, they'd have better access to like visual representation of the soldiers that they so admire, right? So, I'm not the biggest fan of Americana colors. Uh, like, just, it just looks, it just looks like silly football paint. Uh, but I do like, I do like the design. I do like it. So I might do that one, but I do think I like this one a little better. I'm actually torn. Let's do this one for a bit. I honestly like it. I like... I like the way it accentuates her face, like her facial structure. This one, this one too, I think makes her eyes, like accentuates her eyes in an odd way. I don't know what it is, but I think it does. Oh, I think it's because the, I don't know. I don't know what it is, but I like, it. I like them both. But this one, this one also matches what I'm wearing pretty well. We'll go with this one for a bit. I do like it. They have the salutes too. It's so odd. Like, it makes sense, right? Because they had, they were the only ones, potentially, I think the only tribes in the whole, like, North American continent that had access to, like, better visual representations, like holograms and stuff that actually worked. So it makes sense, like, they have, and they had, like, the, the better audio and stuff. Like, not a lot, but some. So it would definitely explain why they have those phrases and mannerisms. It's just interesting. Pew pew. I guess I could have gone here. <laughs> but I did want to check out and see if they, if they had a weapon that I wanted. And they did. They had the rope caster, except now I think the I think I've been again. I think I've built up this idea of what it is in my head, and they don't explain it until you fully until you buy it, which is ridiculous. Like, if it's a new weapon type, like give me like as soon as I hover over it, let me let me see what it is. You know, let me see the full description of what it's capable of. I really want lowland armor too. I think the lowland armor looks really, really cool. We're back in the desert. Woo! -hoo. Um. Oh, I bet you I need to go up to the very tippy, 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 tippy top up there. Yep, that's probably where I need to go. Man, I got all the way up there earlier just for funsies, and now I'm like, oh, now I gotta, now I gotta do it for realsies. Gotta climb up to look for silver but where Yeah, where to start? Who knows? It's not like I spent 30 minutes up here playing with the photo mode or anything. Okay. Let's see if I can pick up Silga's signal. On top of a man-made not a not a Gaia made, a Hephaestus made tonic. <laughs> Well, I got more of the message, but not enough to find the source yet. Climbing the mountain where my base is should finish the job. Sure. Itsy peasy, lemon squeezy. A part of me feels like I should just run through. Especially because it's an easy way to fight machines and get shards and stuff. But I'm also like, ah, uh, it's for convenience to say. But it is fun. Like, I do enjoy, like, it's kind of like those those no fast travel Skyrim runs. Or, like, the one, I think some of those runs will let you use, like, the in-game, um, like, city to city like carts that you can use to fast travel but there are some people that will just walk skyrim which is great like i love it you know i would i love to do that too just taking in the scenery having that little tiny bit of realism extra realism i guess 
I see you, champion. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sit. no, I'm good. Please. I'm good. You shouldn't miss this chance to trade. Trade what? <laughs> oh. Oh. Wow. Wow. <laughs> well, why? Why are none of these? I do like. I do like the face paint. It looks extra good with Nora stuff too. Why can't I get any Tanakh stuff? Like I got the Tanakh. Where? Where? How did I get the um, Tanakh? Oh, jeez. Um, where am I going? Where did I get the Tanakh? Uh, desert time. armor that I got, you know? The southern Ooh. face is my best bet for a climb if I want to get more of Silka's message. Just gotta look. We just gotta go over to it. Oh. I was like, what? <laughs> also, I definitely saw something scanning. <sighs> There is a there is a chest down there. But I'm I'm busy. I mean if you if you say that I could probably just activate. Oh you've got a sonar. Oh that's what it does, that's right. Maybe I'll just run past it for now. If I even have enough for it, I do. Oh, I can't see if I can climb this. That's that. Uh, that's sad. I was trying to stealth kill it, but I apparently just whacked it. I should have overridden it too, because that would then I could make it aggressive, and that would have been just so much smarter. But alas, here we are. Now that I got rid of the one that was super angry with me, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna go a sunwing site. I do need some sunwing stuff. I know that. Oh, cool. Ow. Oh, there. At least that. Okay, well, that worked. Oh, ow. Hang on. I apparently need to. What do we do with this? Oh. Thought I was asking me to reload. Holy cow, the blast pace needed for that. Those are the piercing bolts. Those are the explosive. Okay. Oh. That's cheating. I can give 
keep going. Never where. Oh, did I kill it? Okay. Still made a clone higher. Okay, I don't know how much easier that was, but uh, but there you go. Is there more that can see me? I feel like it's the leap leashers, the leap lashers. I can't. <laughs> I feel like they're somehow still seeing me because uh, uh, I don't know. There's a glitch, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> what a view! Some of these places. Probably including, like, obviously including that, the mountain I was just on. But some of these places, you could probably get the, the achievement, that gliding achievement off of. Yeah, no, I just saw the little, like, um, the very tiny uh, alarm marker go off. I'm pretty sure something's bugged and the, the le leashers, slashers, are uh, somehow still sensing me. Because it was way below me. Well, hopefully for this mission, I don't have to be like undetected because uh, to like get it to, to get it to work. to fight okay. anything up here because this is like the worst spot. Whoa, 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 whoa. Nope, hang on. I should try to find a good spot. Yeah, to I, I know. I'm well aware. Vantage. There. Found the origin. It's not too far from here. It's breaking my heart. To get to it. Hearing her voice, like the sadness in there. Oh my gosh. Bet I'll get a nice view if I glide down from here. Well, and I like him. I like that. What is it? The um, like I don't know, that one of the like sort of side focuses. Oh, it's plain song. Is like getting all these snippets of people because all of us, I think most people would hope that if the world came to an end or something like some snippet of you would remain for somebody else to see in the future. You know. That there's some connection to the future and that there, I guess in some way, it's like you, you, you live forever in that way. And that, that's what, that's the hope, right? I think it's like, this like inherent, like hope that all people have that they can connect. Sort of a living forever thing, but like more like your memory lives forever. You know, like the Greeks did it with like, you know, tales of valor and stuff. Like that was their hope, right? Was that they could live forever, um... You know, through tales of their valor, you know, very in like oral histories, you know, so that certain things aren't forgotten and all this stuff. Like it's very, it's a very human urge, I feel. So it feels very intimate to be able to look into these the snapshot of these people's lives. Some of them were like during like the, when things were okay, and some of them when things were not. And like you can't see this person and you don't know their life, but like you get this snippet of them, and in a way, it feels like a responsibility to like carry that memory you know what i mean i don't know maybe i'm just going off like yeah you know just it's just interesting and i think for a lot of people they would hope 
even even without like an end of world scenario, like you hope that um, somehow in some way you you can live on after you've gone, you know, or that others that you love can live. You know what I mean? Like you don't want like you have loved ones that you want to be able to live on, you know, like through their memories and I don't know. I'm not saying it very well because it's kind of hard to philosophize when I'm trying to play a video game, <laughs> but yeah, it's just interesting to think about. And so, like, I don't know, I just like that this game has that, has that aspect that... What? Oh my gosh, I almost freaking, I almost freaking stopped the recording, what the heck? That was weird. That was that was terrifying, honestly. I thought I thought my HDMI cords were glitching out. Like I literally had my hand on the button. Oh my gosh, a fox. Do I need that? The snowfall's blanketing the land. Anyway, now that I've been distracted from my philosophizing. I just think about it sometimes how like the the the, the desire to like live beyond yourself like I look at I look at rock art a lot you know and like the 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 desire to like have this memory this vestige of yourself even if it's like without your name that there's a piece of you that lives on in the future and I think a lot of people will hope that right like even like now and in the past like that 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 you will make a mark on the world in such a way like maybe not a big mark but like you will make some mark on the world and live on through your deeds or your like memory you know or through like a physical monument you know ancient um and modern leaders do it too but like you know like ancient and modern leaders like especially like i'm reading a lot of like no 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 we are not doing this Here I come. um like uh ancient near east shoot i can't remember his name off the top of my head but, like, a lot of them did this where they would put, like, actual, like, just, like, stone pillars inscribed with their deeds on them. Um, this is, oh, it's a rebel base at, like, a water tower. Interesting. Um, but, yeah, like, stuff like that. Well, that, that's, like, an extreme example, maybe, in some case. But, like, even people who don't want to live, like, grandiose lives, they want to have something that lives beyond them. That was something that they did. You know? My focus is picking up the signal that Silka found. I'll need to clear out the machines before I can look for the source. What machine? Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. Could use that in the fight. I was definitely 100%. This was a whoopsie daisy. I need to clear out these ones? Will, what, will this work? Listen, I, I can't do anything about me being here. I realize this is less than ideal. But please bear with me. So it just hurts my heart a little bit. I think it maybe hits a little close to home with uh, the whole, like hearing these people's like last moments, or even just any moment really, that they are having. The last ones though are especially like, look at how little damage I'm doing to this thing. This does. And then I need to hit it with a fire arrow, I think. Oh, time to pull out the fire weapon. Where did it go? Didn't do very much damage at all, honestly. 
Hush you. What's that? Oh. Wait, 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 what? What? Was there a... Oh, hi. Hi. Oh, jeez. Oh, was that a machine that I was, like, trying to... Scan? Over there? Somewhere? That it was like, oh, this is a new machine. 